It has been two weeks since the Alabama Court of Criminal Appeals reversed the murder conviction of former Huntsville police officer William Ben Darby. The appeals court remanded the case back to Madison County, setting the stage for a new trial. A strict timeline was set for the Alabama Attorney General's office to appeal that decision. News 19's Mariah Wiggs joins us live now. Mariah, where does this case stand at this point? Ladies, the attorneys for former HPD officer William, excuse me, William Darby are waiting for a response this morning as to whether his previous bond will be reinstated. This after the Alabama Attorney General's office did not request a rehearing from the Court of Criminal Appeals. The Court of Criminal Appeals had a stipulated 14 days for a request to a rehearing, but that window closed on Friday. This means that the Attorney General's office can no longer go to the state. Supreme Court to overturn the appeals court ruling. The motion by Darby's defense to reinstate his bond was filed on Sunday morning. Darby had been sentenced to 25 years in prison for the 2018 on duty shooting of Jeffrey Parker. The appeals court found the trial judge should have instructed the jury to evaluate the fatal shooting based on how a reasonable police officer would have responded. The appeals court remanded the case back to Madison County, setting the stage for a new trial. Darby's defense attorney Robert Tootin believes even if a petition for a rehearing was filed, it wouldn't be successful in the end. It should be noted that we reached out to the attorney general's office during the appeals window. The AG's office said it had no comment as to any plans for response. Again, Darby's case has been remanded back to the trial court here in Madison County. Reporting live this morning, Mariah Wiggs, News 19.